So I would say that the ability to connect with people and feel like I am helping them on their journey, especially helping them walk a path that is kind of uncharted for them in many respects, and helping them feel safe while they walk that journey um, is really important to me. My journey into medicine was um, an evolution over time. My dad was actually a college professor here locally in math, but I really liked science, I really liked biology, and I wanted to be a teacher. It began to evolve that I wanted to do something in healthcare rather than in teaching. So the thing I like about maternal fetal medicine as a specialty is that it actually is a blend of many specialties. So on one hand, I went back to my family practice roots because maternal fetal medicine is basically internal medicine and radiology and some surgery and of course obstetrics um, all blended you know, together, plus the, the challenge of complications. We do a lot of ultrasound, um, so that's the radiology aspect of things. That's the key component for fetal medicine really is being able to look at the baby and see that's our ability that's our physical diagnosis of the baby and the technology for that has changed tremendously over the years what I could see when I began my career is so small compared to what I can see now so it's a combination of all of those things but ultimately the goal of maternal fetal medicine is to take a pregnancy that is complicated or has the potential of being complicated and bring it to fruition where we have a safe mom, a safe baby, and a good outcome. I really enjoy helping people. I mean, I think that's cliche, but that's, that is part of what drove me into the area or guided me into the area, is the ability to follow my scientific interest, um, but also be able to feel like I'm giving back to people and helping them in their own lives. I spend a lot of time educating, so I go back to my teaching desires. Um, I spend a lot of time educating patients, you know, sitting at their bedside, explaining the, uh, the physiology, the why is their body doing this, you know, what will we do to affect the situation, what does that do to them, what does that do to the baby. I spend a lot of time um, explaining to the families um, who are involved to help them understand, because you can understand that it's a very stressful time for people. It's very rewarding. There's obviously the intellectual stimulation of the science. Um, I've gotten back into teaching from the standpoint of teaching patients and teaching residents. But the biggest reward is feeling like you've helped someone, that you've made a positive influence, you've changed the outcome, you've changed the trajectory of what would have been, um, and you've made it a better trajectory. That's, that's very rewarding to me.